Hey guys, good morning. Welcome back to the channel. Oh, just just give me a sec. Oh. Ever feel like sometimes you wake up tired? Well, we're gonna be discussing something which can help you with that. We're gonna delve into the realm of morning and evening routines. And you know, eat morning routines set you up for the day, right? But you know what's even better? An evening routine that sets up your morning routine. A killer evening routine is gonna help you have a killer morning routine. You might be thinking, why bother? I wake up just fine. Well, it's not just about waking up. It's about setting yourself up for the day so that you can have an amazing day, no matter what comes your way. You probably clicked on this video because I called you lazy, right? It's all right, we're all in this together, mate. At the end of the video, I'll show you what my morning and evening routine looks like at times. So, let's get into it. I probably should get out of bed, actually. Can't be talking about morning and evening routines while I'm sat in my bed, right? All right, let's break it down. There are some amazing benefits to having a consistent morning routine. First of all, it mentally prepares you for the day ahead. Do you ever have those chaotic mornings which are like, ah, I'm late for work, ah, I've woke up late, oh, I don't know where everything is, and all this anxiety and all of that is coming up, and it often leads to having a more chaotic day? Well, a morning routine can help you start the day off right. It sets the tone for your whole day. Whenever I go to the gym in the morning, like have a sauna, go to the sauna afterwards, and then do a bit of meditation in the day, oh, nothing can stop me. It's the best feeling in the world. Secondly, productivity skyrockets. It goes high, it goes motherfucking high. Your productivity increases tenfold. There are no more half done projects, no more half done to-do lists. You're able to get everything you need to do done during the day. And if you don't, then hey, sometimes you don't finish your to-do list. But with a morning routine, it is going to increase the chances that you're not going to bed thinking, oh, I didn't do this. Oh, I didn't do that. Oh, what am I gonna do? And then you gotta go to bed. And it's like, I can't do anything. Ah, so, Product, so that helps your productivity. Having a morning routine stops you from feeling Ugh. Third, taking control of your morning routine means that you can take control of your day. You don't have to be pulled in each direction. Like, hoo, hoo, hoo. But instead, you can be the one steering the ship like a captain steering the ship. Mm, 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 mm. Look at me, I'm cruising through my day. Mm, mm. That could be you, that could be you. And lastly, let's talk about energy. Boosting those energy levels early in the morning is gonna be a game changer. Whether that's going to the gym, doing some meditation, or taking a cold shower. I'm actually gonna let you in on something with a cold shower, right? So, you know a cold shower can boost your dopamine levels by 200%, and that energy lasts almost the whole day. But here's something that's even more crazy, right? You know that drug cocaine that people just do a little sniffy of the lines? Well, that also gives you the same level of energy during the day, but you know, it's an A-class drug, kind of dangerous, kind of wrecks your body. I mean, we all know the down pits of doing cocaine, right? But imagine if you can have the same high as people do with cocaine, but instead, it's just a cold shower. None of the drawbacks. It's legal, it's free. Anyone can take a cold shower. Even if you don't have heating in your house, guess what, you're taking a cold shower anyway. So why not take some of these tips and understand how a morning routine can help you become much better you. Much better you didn't make sense, but I'm gonna roll with it. So I did mention at the start of this video that we were talking about evening routines and morning routines. So we've done the morning, let's go to the evening. But wait, we're not done. 
Let's talk about night routines and the benefits of them. We have a circadian rhythm that, you know, runs on the 24 hour clock and making sure that a circadian rhythm is on lock is the key to healthy sleep. Things first, consistency is key. Set a time for you to wake up and go to bed regularly and that is going to help your circadian rhythms stay in lock. It's like a dance routine for your body, like, mmm, mmm. Mm, mm, mm. This is what your body could be doing with its patterns. <laughs> now, wind down time is crucial. Put your phones away, put the screens away. Make sure that at least 30 minutes before you go to bed that there are no screens. Instead, try reading a book, try journaling. Try meditating or maybe listening to some nice calm music. Like, you know, those like, oh, what are those called? Lo-fi beats or like some nature sounds or something, you know. I mean, if you can fall asleep to a David Attenborough documentary, which I've done a few times. Sorry, David, you're great, but sometimes I fall asleep. So try those things to help you get ready for sleep because I promise you, you're going to be waking up so much more refreshed and you're going to be able to get to sleep easier. Now, here is the magic, right? I got the magic in me. Every time you touch that track, it turns into gold. Yes, it turns to gold. Every time I look uh, 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 magic in me. Oh, sorry, hold on. <laughs> I got way too happy. That's a great song, by the way. But the magic of what I'm talking about is that if you have a successful evening routine, it sets you up to have a killer morning routine. I know that whenever I want to go to the gym or anything else in the morning, if I'm making sure that I'm in my bed by 10 o'clock, falling asleep by 10.30, that I can wake up at 5.55, go to the gym, you know, go to the sauna and then do some meditation, like write what I've got to do for my day or my to-do list, then I've already set myself up for success. Set yourself up for success. Here's a little tip. If you want to get up and go to the gym in the morning, this is what I do and it absolutely helps me, right? I pack my bag the day before. In the evening, pack my bag for the gym. Everything's in there, everything I need. I even put my car keys in there so I don't forget anything, right? And then have your gym clothes set out somewhere for you to be able to just pick them up, pop them on. And here is something else, right? You know those phones that we have that just, you know, ring alarm bells and all of that? Well, what I'd say is, if you charge your phone next to your bed where it's easy for you to go, snooze, you're not setting yourself up for success. So what I try and do, I put my phone on the other side of my bedroom, right? And then when the alarm goes off, I wake up and I have to get out of bed. I physically have to get out of bed and switch it off. Now, don't get me wrong. There are times I go and switch it off and head back to bed. But it really helps me just make sure that I'm out of my bed and I'm like more likely to go to the gym in the morning. Now, take a moment to reflect on how your current routines are serving you. Are they holding you back? Or are they letting you shine like the person you are? Hmm? I'm gonna let you think on that for a second. All right, here comes the big moment. You might be thinking, are these routines actually gonna help me change? Well, we've got so much precious time on this earth. Time's a resource, you know, time's a resource. So why not maximize all the time that we have on this precious earth? No more pondering, no more overthinking. Embrace change. Put these routines into action. And I bet you, I bet you that once you put these routines into place, you're gonna start meeting your goals, conquering life, and motherfucking season the day. Carpe in the damn, okay? Okay, I might seem aggressive about this, but I just know the power of a morning and evening routine, man. And I want you to succeed. Before we, before we wrap up this video, right? Listen, I am perfect. There are so many times in where I'm just hitting the snooze button on my alarm, or I'm just binge watching Netflix on my laptop. You know, recently I've been watching Derry Girls. Oh my gosh, Derry Girls is so hilarious. Don't know why I didn't watch it before, but 
I'll show you. I'll show you. I'll show you what it looks like at times for me. So here's the deal. Let's aim to be our best selves. In my world, a successful morning routine sets you up to have an epic day, no matter what life throws at you. And a killer evening routine means that you are getting more sleep, that you're getting more restful sleep, and that you're waking up the next day to just have it on repeat, to continue the success. It's a win-win. It's a cog that just keeps cogging. Listen. I'm on a journey to become my best self, and I really want that for you too. Here at Tino Talk, we're ensuring that black men are getting the resources and the tools and the skills to become better men. Because guess what? Becoming a better man means that we're just gonna be able to hit our goals. We're gonna be able to live the life that we wanna live. And also, there's nothing wrong with becoming a better man, right? There's so many benefits to being able to realize where we are in life and how we want to be in life. So if you guys found this video helpful, please leave a like, subscribe, and I want you to comment in the comment section what your morning and evening routine looks like. And if you don't have one, then I want you to comment what your perfect evening and morning routine will look like. Guys, it's your life. Make it fucking extraordinary, okay? Now, that's all from me. See you guys next week.